Oh, he's gonna catch me, isn't he? No? Hmm. Okay then. I'm not gonna argue. How's it going everyone? My name is Blade and welcome back to The Escapists. And in the last episode we started the jungle compound prison and basically we just mounted up a bunch of supplies but we don't really have anything of great use right now. Um, I also got a bit of money for my job. I have $74 right now. Ooh, just on a file. I'm gonna get that. Uh, what else? Nothing. And something I forgot to do last episode is try out for the tailoring job, which I found out you need 30 or more intellect to get, so I gotta train my intellect a little bit, and I have to resign from my gardening job. Get up here, okay. Here's the library. And I'm gonna train my intellect up a little bit, Wait, do the guards not come in here? Because if they don't, I can, like, dig a way out of here and I won't be caught. Why is it so hard to do reps? Do it. Ugh. I don't even know. My fingers are definitely going fast enough, but it's not working for some reason. Oh, exercise period. Great. Um, job board... The tailor is vacant right now, which means I can apply. Yes, I'm the tailor now. Alright, so somebody told me a way that I could get out of the prison, and it involves what I mentioned earlier about getting out through the library. Apparently you can dig out through there at night, uh, just sneak your way in after the roll call. And then you wait here, and you dig your way out, you get in through there, and once you go up into here, there should be some sort of outpost or something. And there are these things called ID papers, which apparently you can use to walk right out of the prison. So I'm going to have to check more into that, uh, and I'll see if I can escape that way. But I'm gonna need a bunch of spoons and stuff. Okay, my first day on the tailoring job. So I go up in here. Okay. Fabric. What do we do with these? Can you. I can't put them on. Oh, okay. You combine a bunch of fabric together and you make clothing. That's much easier than what I thought it was going to be. <laughs> it makes different kinds of clothing, too. It's not just hats. Um, sock. Awesome. So some of this stuff I can actually use. Underwear. <laughs> this job is amazing. I wonder how much it pays. Alright, I completed my first tailoring job, and by the looks of it, I get around $15 for doing it. So it's not the absolute best job, but it's a good job. Um, I'm gonna see if I can actually get into the library, because then I'll have an excuse to, like, go up in here. I'm gonna need to make a poster with some duct tape and a magazine. Flush toilet. Why? Why would I flush a toilet here in the library? I have too much stuff. Sock mace to super glyph. Ooh! Okay. I forgot about the contraband. Alright. So, Mitch hates me now, but... I think I should be able to apply for his job. Library. At least 40 intellect. 
Okay, so I'm gonna reapply for the job in just a minute. Uh, library vacancy, apply. Okay, so now I'm a librarian. <laughs> so this is the exotic feather. Feather. Bleh. I can't talk. Um, that I needed to get in order to escape. So I think I'm gonna buy that off of Baxter. I'd like to buy your exotic feather and I'll buy the duct tape too. Uh, I know. Ooh. <laughs> oh, a flash of the past from when I escaped from that prison just running through. Library job. Okay, so what do I do in the library? I think I take these books to people. Alright, yeah. Um, here, take your book. Truman's book. Do I have another book for Truman? No, I don't. Um, Albert, Craig, Craig has two books. Uh, Byron, I got a book for you. There we go. Wait, Albert, you're... You just fell over and died when I was trying to give you a book. Mango. Wow, this prison has some pretty weird items. Oh, he's gonna catch me, isn't he? No? Hmm. Okay then. I'm not gonna argue. Ow. What, what does Destroyer have against me? Like, literally, he beats me up for anything. Mitch is right here. I'm trying to give you a book. Do you mind? Just not attack me for no reason. I'm getting more than enough exercise trying to run away from the st stupid guard. But Skeletor had a tribal drum. Once again, so many weird items in this prison. Foil! Perfect! Um... So now, if I can get more duct tape somewhere, then I can go over and put this poster in. Okay, so now I think I have an idea of what I want to do to try and escape. Um, but it's going to be requiring me to get quite a bit of material. I'm gonna need cutters, I'm gonna need a multi-tool which requires the pickaxe and the shovel, but they need to be sturdy, so a bunch of duct tape. <sighs> um, I don't really know, do I have enough intelligence to craft this yet? Yes, I do. Okay, so now I should be able to just knock down the first guard I see, aside from these guys, because they're going to attack me. <gasps> what? What? <laughs> okay, that was really bad. I shouldn't have gone through there. I forgot that they have the, the guard towers. Should have knocked down Destroyer, he's always attacking me. Alright, so now I can get to digging that hole on the wall again. I got the poster, but I need the duct tape. So let's search everybody's desks. Okay, so basically I just need a ton of duct tape. Wait, why is it sideways? Are they gonna notice that if it's sideways? I hope not. I'm on the roof. Uh, prisoner stash. Flimsy pickaxe, that's exactly what I wanted to get. Um, but I can't bring that across, so let's just drop it here. 
Okay. So, it looks like this idea might work. Uh... I'll have to be a bit careful about how I do it, though. What was that? Man, I swear this game has some of the weirdest glitches sometimes. <laughs> what? I was already past him and then all three of them, like, yelled at me. Okay, so if anybody's selling duct tape, that will be really useful. Why does Mitch have so many books? He has, he has four books. Holy crap. Well, here's the new plan. I'm gonna try to dig through here and take some of the timber supplies and possibly that prisoner stash. I hope that it has, uh, like a shovel or something I can use in it. Oh, there's the truck. Um, now that, hey, that's something that I might need to worry about, because wouldn't the truck, like, I don't know, catch me on sight if they saw me trying to escape? I don't know. I definitely know that the truck runs at night, because I've heard it going through. I just wonder if there's a way to stop it. Alright, now I should be able to make my contraband pouch. Uh, let's see. Perfect. Okay, now I've got the contraband pouch and I can move all my valuable items into the library area. Another tribal drum, I can't really use that for anything. Let's give somebody the chicken. I think Truman was the one who had the really high opinion of me. Uh, yep. So now, he's got an opinion of 82. Wait, what? Who's fighting? I don't, I don't even know anymore. Uh, we had a hammer. That's all like. Wait, that was Truman. Wow. Alright, um. Nothing really I can use. Yeah, I think that's about all that I'll really need to begin an escape. But I don't know if I'm going to be able to escape in the next couple episodes, or the next few episodes, or next episode, whatever it is. But, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, feel free to leave a like and a positive comment. Also, subscribe to see my new videos as soon as they come out. Thank you guys once again for watching, and I will see you...